sales. Today I want to show you around this Glastrum GS209 Cuddy. It's a 21 foot Cuddy cabin. It's fitted with a Volvo Penta 4.3 litre GXI fuel injected 225 horsepower stern drive engine. It has only got 118 hours on the clock. It's a one owner from New Boat. It's an absolutely immaculate condition throughout. Fantastic entry level sports Cuddy. Um, great for family water sports, spending the odd night on board. And this one with an excellent spec with a twin wheel. A roller coaster road trailer, full set of camper covers, GPS chart plotter. So this boat is just under 21 foot long. It's 20 foot 10 inches long and it is 7 foot 10 inches wide. Uh, so it's great size for larger lakes or scooting about the coast. Um, nice sort of entry level family cuddy style sports boat and it is, is an absolutely immaculate condition throughout. The exterior looks almost as good as new. We've got a nice uh, stainless steel anchor roller on the bow. We've got stainless steel rub rail insert all the way around. Nice stainless steel horn grill there. Navy blue hull color band with the original glass drum graphics. The hull bottom has never been anti-fouled. This boat has never been kept in the water. It's always been launched and recovered off the trailer. So the original gel coat finish on the bottom. The stern corner is unmarked as is the corner of the swim platform. It's also completely unmarked. Just look at the finish in that hull. It just looks fabulous. So all the way down that port side is in mint condition. Often on boats that are live on the trailer and are launched and recovered, you get a lot of gel coat damage at the bow from the trailer, but not so on this boat. The gel coat at the bow is also immaculate. No scuffs or scratches. The glass from badge and the graphics pack are all perfect. Stern corner on this side, again, unmarked. Nice little chrome outlet for the build pump. You get your fuel filler here, stern cleat, and then the extended swim platform, which is a brilliant addition. Very few of these boats uh, have that extended swim platform. So you got a fold out three step stainless steel bathing ladder. As I said, the boat's fitted with a Volvo Penta 4.3 litre GXI V6 engine that makes 225 horsepower and it's matched up to this SX stern drive leg. The boat has been religiously serviced every year throughout its life. The owner actually brought the boat here from his um, maintenance guy. It's been looked after by Tony's Marine, Tony Hodges here in Coleraine. Um, very highly respected mechanic, Volvo Penta specialist and he's he's maintained this thing from new and it is an um, impeccable condition trim pump motor and pipes are all in good condition you can see the bellows there get a better look at the bellows from here the rubber bellows are perfect um again trim ram seals are all good and the propeller it's a 14 and a half by 19 inch pitch propeller standard three blade aluminium prop it's also in good condition so mechanically this boat is immaculate you'll see that whenever we get into the engine bay as well We've been remotely selling boats online for the last sort of 10 years. So we're really experienced with how this process works. So if you're looking at this boat, but you're not close by or, or um, you know, you can't travel because of the lockdowns and things, um, it's, it's not an issue. This video hopefully will give you a really good idea of the condition that it's in. We can also do additional walk around videos or FaceTime viewings with you, not a problem. We can put you in touch with third party surveyors who can come and independently inspect the boat on your behalf. We can also do a virtual sea trail for you. We run the boat in the water, video it or while you're on FaceTime and so you can see exactly how the boat performs. And we can also help you out with logistics of getting the boat delivered to your home marina. So if you want to find out how that process works, um, or you got any questions about it, please don't hesitate to get in touch with me. Give me a shout, give me a call or send me an email. Stepping on board the boat, then um, with the jump seats removed from either side of that engine box, you can hop into the cockpit quite easily over either side. Pretty traditional layout. You've got a pedestal side seats up forward for the helmsman and the front seat passenger. You've got this engine box and then the two seats that slot in either side of that. So you'll comfortably seat four people and you've still got a ton of uh, deck space in the boat. Plenty of room for people to stand or to store gear or water sports equipment or that type of thing. The deck is done with uh, this marine grade sort of teak effect, synthetic teak, which looks nice. Nice white caulk lines. Definitely looks really smart. The upholstery is all nice and up-to-date looking and it's all in immaculate condition. Because this is a 2010 boat, 
it was a sort of, you know, it was there were big updates done in those years over the sort of earlier 06, 07, 08 boats. So you get things like uh, stainless steel handrails, uh, stainless steel stereo covers, upgraded uh, seats, beautiful bucket style seats with flip up bolsters and nice glass room badges laid into them. You got the teak floor, um, you got stainless steel cup holders everywhere as well. Um, so just a lot of nice finishing touches that make this feel more luxurious than earlier model years. Lovely steering wheel on it, solid wood steering wheel as well with a stainless steel centre. You've got this cushion on top of the engine box, so you could have a passenger sit there. Nice Glastron logo laid into that. Um, and if you want to, you can lift these cushions up. They slot in at this higher level and they make that a full width sun pad as well. So I'll just show you here. Take the cushion out of here. You slide it in there. And then you've got a nice sun pad across the transom. Bottom shift lever, lever falls easily to the hand. Beautiful steering wheel on this one. Um, a nice suite of gauges. And I've got clear visibility straight through the windscreen here. If I put the bolster up, then my eye level is about here. So you're looking clean, clear over the top of the screen. Um, so if you want to do that, if you're coming in the breadth of the boat or if you're towing water toys or water skiers, you can get better visibility. But sitting down, you're well protected from the screen and good visibility. And we've got a Lowrance GPS over here as well. Again, we'll take a look at that on the sea trail, but in perfect working order. So lovely helm position, beautiful fully finished steering wheel. Everything's nice and tidy and in operational condition. Access into the cuddy cabin then is through this little folding door. So all the wee clips and catches are all working perfectly. So you can clip the door open. Um, again, all, everything in this boat, pretty much perfect condition. And then we'll turn on the lights with the light switch on the dash. There we go. And a nice wee cuddy cabin, which makes up into a V berth. There's a filler cushion there, so you can make that into a v, full V berth, so there is room to sleep on board. You can see in here, you've got your battery isolator switch, and we've got the hour clock beside it, so it's currently showing 118.4 hours. Now that will increase slightly because we still have to take this boat to the water and do the sea trial with it, but it's going to be like 119 or something. The engine itself is in immaculate condition. The boat comes with um, a full set of camper covers as well as a tonneau cover. So it has a flat tonneau cover, which buttons on to these buttons around the bottom of the windscreen. That's your, your storage cover. And you'd also use that whenever you're towing the boat on the road. And then it has these full height camper covers for whenever you're on board, if the rain starts or you know, if you're using the boat early in the season or late into the autumn and you just want it a wee bit warmer inside, you can put those covers up and run the boat with the covers on. They're in excellent condition. The, the owner told me he never used them. I don't even think he had them on. So we fitted them for the first time. And uh, as you can see, they're like brand If you're interested in this Glastron GS209 and you want to find out more about it, then please sign up for VIP access on our website at gulfstreamboatsales.com. All you have to do is pop your name and email address into the box below this video on our site and you can get VIP access, which is completely free. Once you've signed up, then navigate back to the Glassroom 209 page and you can watch our full length video tour where we go through the boat in a lot more detail. We show you around all the storage compartments, give you a really good look around the engine bay. You can also watch the full extent of the water test videos that we have and just find out what this boat's all about and help. hopefully it'll help you to figure out whether it might be the right one for you. So that's sign up for VIP access at GulfstreamBoatSales.com. Thank you very much for watching.